lovely humus. Humus, humus, humus. Yeah, so enjoy Who got porn on today? Free, free, I don't know, Mexican painter. That Nancy Reagan. Nice. That is nice stuff right there. Nancy Reagan? Yeah. Okay. Who got born? Nancy, Nancy Reagan. Reagan. Ronald Reagan's wife? 1921. Yeah. 1921. Fuck, man. When did she die now? 2016, I believe. Just two years ago. So she was over 100. Oh, no, she wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, 1921. She was, she was goddamn close, near 100. Close. She's fucking close, man. She's goddamn near 100 years old. What year did Ronald die? Do we know? Oh, fuck that me. silly bastard. Well, it's got to be, what, 15 years? I don't have a fuck clue. I don't know, man. Yeah, he was pretty funny. Bill Haley. Bill Haley and the Comets. He did the ro rock around your cock. <sighs> no. A good one. It was not rock around your cock, Rick. It should have been. It's a lot better if it says that. He was born in Michigan. He rock wasn't born around in 1980. We're gonna rock, rock, rock. One, two, three o'clock. What would the lyrics be? One, two, three o'clock. Time to suck cock. What was it? One, two, three o'clock. Time to suck cock. Four, five, eleven. Four, five, eleven? I don't know. <laughs> Bob's mad. You got you should maybe go see a doctor, man. You're a little, you're really fucked. Dude, you're probably fucked. Probably dehydrated. I am dehydrated, and I've got sunstroke. I think your brain got fucking... I got sunstroke. Underneath that, there's a brain, and that got sunburned as well. It fucked her all My up. My brain it's didn't get burned. Circuits crossing and electrical storms not happening in the right places. If anybody knows about fucking circuits crossing in your brain, it's you. Janet Lee, American Oxygen in Psycho. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. yeah. Bruce Lee's. George W. What the fuck? So George W. Bush and Nancy Reagan were both born on the same day? Yeah. I wonder if they ever had an affair because of that. Hmm? George Bush Jr. never banged Nancy Reagan. I'm pretty sure. I bet George you. Bush Sr. might have. He might have taken a ride. What flavor of these fucking things? They're like a nice... It's a Salt fuck. And peppery kind it's a of? no, it's a fuck flavor. It's a beautiful. It? It's beautiful. It's like a salt and pepper. Holy fuck. One of Julian's idols. It's like a salt and pepper cheese flavor. It's like fucking sour cream and onion shit, man. Yeah, could be. You ready, ready for this one, Julian? Up. What? You ready to get it? Yeah. Direction? Hmm. Or what? Rambo. Here. Got born today. Why would I get Sly a Stallone, as you like to call him, old Sly. Sylvester Stallone, yeah. You an actor? No, but you call him old Sly. I don't call him old Sly. Never remember, met the guy. I would like to meet him. He's probably got a lot remember of Remember when stories. you bought the knife at the top that screwed off that had the compass on it? Everybody bought those fucking knives. And I did buy it. I borrowed it. Remember when you tied something around your arm? I did do that, and that was for fucking Halloween. You remember when you cut yourself and tried to sew yourself back up and it didn't go very well, so you had to go to the hospital? It was an accident, and I did fucking get a few stitches in. But it wasn't fun. I showed you how to cauterize it with gunpowder, but you wouldn't do it. No, man. You were fucked up. All right, who else do we got? 50 Cent. 1975, okay. He's what, 40? 50 Cent was only born in 1975. Young fucker. 43. Yeah, he's like 43, 42, 43, 50 cent. Who else? I wonder if, if he's, he I bet a... his 50th birthday, I bet it's going to be a big one. It's going to be a gong show, man. If he lives that long. 50 turns 50. Yeah. That's the slogan, I bet. Yeah. Mm. Does he have any kids? I wonder what he named them. Like, would he name them Nickel and Dime? Quarter. <laughs> Quarter. Mooney. <laughs> Well, they couldn't be more than he is. He's only 50 cents, so he couldn't, they couldn't be... Oh, I wasn't even thinking about that, man. No, they have to be smaller denominations to change. Penny, quarter, penny. Yep, but there's lots of pennies out there. Quarter, dime, nickel, penny. Penny well, cent. I like nickel. Your name. He could have... Nickel's kind of a tough name. Nickel. What's up, nickel? Hey, nickel. Double nickels. What the fuck was 
What's that? Double nickels. Oh, no. <laughs> My double guns. Uh, oh. All right. Boys, I'm drunk. Yeah, okay. You know what? I will drink tonight, but you guys have got to shower tonight, both of you. Okay? I'm not saying at the same time. Kevin Hart got born today, and so did Tay Zonde, American singer and keyboardist from Chocolate Rain. You know them, Bubs? Yeah, Chocolate Rain, Tay Zonde. Okay. Kevin Hart, comedian, born in Philadelphia. He was born today. He was born in 79. He's only how old? 39. Kevin Hart was born in 1979. Oh, he's just, uh, he's fucking... He's in his 30, 30s. He's 38, man. He's 38. 39, for fuck's sake. 38 years old, never kissed a girl. He's 38 years old, never kissed a... I'm sure Kevin Hart has kissed many ladies. Probably does dirty stuff a lot. Because he's famous. Wow, it's good to is isn't he? They got a lot of crazy shit over in Japan, boys. Like, a lot. Do you think... There's a gadget here that some guy invented over there. It tells you how bad you stink, which I... Oh, a stinkometer. I was going to try to build one of those. You guys will both be off the fucking charts with this thing. A stinkometer. He perfected one. He perfected I swam it. in the lake July 4th, so I'm pretty fucking ripe. I mean, not ripe. Unripe. What's that called? Clean, Ricky. Clean, yes. The problem with body odor is that you can't really smell it on yourself. Yes, you can. If you're fucking stinking, you're like, I stink. Yeah, if not if you always stink. If you always stink, you go nose blind. Don't you know I those commercials? You can still... You well, still if you put your nose it. right in there, you probably know it. But if you're just walking around, you go nose blind to it. Well, yeah. it's a big problem in Japan because you, you go around, walk around, and you're stinking. It's not, it's not good, man. People are fucking not into it. No. People carrying around deodorant. Do you think like, Sam Losco knows what he smells like? No, he does not. Does he? I don't know, man. I think he's fucking. I think he does it on purpose. He stinks it up worse than. No, he's gone nose blind. That's what it is. Nose blind. Never heard of that before, man. You've never seen the commercials for nose blind? Nope. Where they got the kitties and stuff? Wow. I bet you they're making a lot of fucking money off this thing. Why? Who's gonna wear it? Hmm? Stinky people. There's like stink police. Go around oh, and get just, fined. The stink police, they live inside of my head. The stink police, they come to me in my bed. The stink police, they're coming to arrest Ricky. Oh, no. <coughs> Remember Bubs. Cheap Track? Bubs, Why? do you like pigeons? I'm not, no, I'm not fond of pigeons. What is he walking into with the answer? It's called the deadliest flight, man. It's in Taiwan. The deadliest who? They get this big thing. They 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 do it every year. They ah, oh, more than a million pigeons die while competing in Taiwan's controversial pigeon. Mike Tyson races. would not be happy. He would be that. fucking lose. They go way out to sea, right? <coughs> Let all the fucking pigeons go. Yeah. Whoever makes it back to land wins first. So but the rest of them just drown. Terrible. They all fuck. Yeah, they die. They just exhausted. They fucking they die. That's terrible. One percent fucking. Uh, one, only 1% of them fucking actually live. 1%? 1%. So there's dead birds everywhere. So man. 10 pigeons out of 1,000. Is that 1%? Yeah, yeah 10%, 10% would be 100. Yeah. So, so they let talking... go 1,000 pigeons and only oh, like 10 of them million. make it? A million, bud. Oh, a million. So 1% is, or 10% is 100,000. 1% is 1,000, isn't it? 10,000. So right. out of a million pigeons, only 10,000 make it? Something like that. That's terrible. What's a multi-billion dollar fucking pigeon race, man? The fucking money they're making. All right. That's not... You shouldn't put a price on pigeons. All right, give... It's good for the sharks. You know what? I would do it once. I would gamble, fucking sell my trailer, everything, throw it in on one of these pigeons, make sure it's the one that's going to win. So that's what they do? They put little numbers on them and they bet on them? Yeah. Oh, my God. Do you get to feel them? Check out their muscles and... Hmm. The what? Measure their heart rate, blood pressure. I don't fucking know what they do. They, there's a lot of money being fucking won, though. And the thing is, the worst thing is, you let them out, they're all crammed in these little cages. They just fly into each other and knock each other, you know, out, and they land in the fucking water. So it's like a NASCAR race. Yeah. Coming, out of, you coming off the start. If I was a pigeon, I would jump on other pigeons and let them do all the work for a bit and then go to the next one and save your energy. 
millions of dead birds. But they probably don't know, Ricky. Like, they probably don't know they're in a race. And they're... Holy fuck. Do they at least point them towards land? Or No, they... man. So it's Look like... at this. Oh, just a second. Nah, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> fucking listen to you. I see a bunch of fucking birds dive bombing into the sea. That's terrible. That's a terrible. Oh, it's a big problem, man. What country is this in? Taiwan. Fuck. Those silly bastards. Put them in these containers. 150 kilometers. 150 kilometers. Jesus Christ. Look at that. Oh, that's terrible. Little, little fuckers. Look, that's a big fucking ship, man. That'd be carry a million. Here we go. Whoa. How the fuck do you know where to go? That's terrible. I see what some the fuck is wrong with those people? Don't know. Oh, look, they're hitting the fucking sea, man. Whoa. Yeah. I made it fucking 10 feet they can't, from the ship. Can they swim? No. Well, they, pigeons must be able to float a little bit like ducks. Yeah, maybe they don't die until a shark comes up and eats them. How did 5,036 came back? The winds, wings were broken, legs broken. Jesus Christ. And these people don't give a fuck. Animal cruelty. They should, you know what they should do? Take the organizers out to sea. Yeah, I was just going to say. Fucking fire swear. them in the ocean. Say, okay, boys, we're back. Good on. luck. You're all numbered. You're all numbered there, dickweeds. Yeah. Start swimming. That's what I do. That pisses me off. Stupid bastards. Poor little pigeons. I mean, I don't like pigeons, but. I wouldn't fucking do that to them. It's like shark cock soup. It's like what? Shark cock soup. Shark they cock. Pull up the sharks in the water, cut their fucking cocks and fins off, and throw them back, still alive. And the sharks can't swim and they die. Their cocks. Well, mostly it's about their fins, so I've added on the cocks. But why who, Why are they cutting the cocks off? It's, okay, it's shark fin soup. They cut they, the fins off. He just put the cocks in there for dramatic purposes. Oh, yes, because he likes to talk about cocks. Not true. Shark cocks. Shark fin soup? Terrible. Yeah, fucking not... thing. Monkey brain sushi? Terrible. Never had that before. Well, no kidding, Ricky. They don't do it over here. But you know what they do in some no. of those countries? They take monkeys. <clears throat> they got a table and it's got holes in it. Yeah. You jam the monkey's head up through the thing and you clamp him in. And then you just fucking knock his head open and you eat his brains right out of his head. Fresh. Jesus Christ. They do it. Monk Wasn't there a movie like that? Hannibal Lecter yeah. was doing that to the he guy. Ate, he ate Ray Liotta's brain. Yeah, he had him cooking his meal while he was eating his brain. <laughs> but that's just make-believe. They actually do that with the monkeys. <clears throat> what if they did it to the monkeys, the band? Do hey, what? hey, we're the monkeys. People try to eat our brains. The monkeys. Put the monkeys in the table and... Knock the, the singers. Yeah, knock Davy Jones' head open. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Man, you're getting crazy. That sunburn's really Hey, hey, smell. we're the monkeys. Somebody's eating my brain. You gotta stay out of the sun, man. It's making <laughs> you crazy. Yeah, man. No, I don't, I don't, don't put them back. Why? Because your fingers are all fucked. They're like grabbing shit, man. 